We're here at the red line at the Source Gaming Lounge, waiting for the next match to pop up. I can't wait. Super excited. So I'm, so I'm really excited to be here. Mr. Javago should be accompanying me soon. We're here at the Source Gaming Lounge, and oh, the the, the tension is palpable right now. <laughs> I can't, I can't wait. Amazing last round, man. I, I saw you pulling it out in Vega. Uh, I, tr I was trying, dude. Like, I, I'm so cl I'm so rusty because I only play basically at these tournaments. So, like, I came in and only got, like, two games to practice. Like, like two or three. And then, like, uh, just wasn't able to get warmed up fast enough against that Ibuki. It's scary. Yeah, he was he was uh he was playing offensive the whole match. As soon as you yeah, put down the was. blades and started playing offensive, you 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 were taking it, man. You were taking yeah, it. Yeah, I, I I gotta get in there. That's a little thing. That's Street Fighter Five, man. It's like who gets in first. But I don't think we've officially met yet. I'm Khalif. Hey, Khalif. Javago. I'm uh, Lloyd. Lloyd. Lloyd Bus. Lloyd Bus. Javago. Nice, nice to meet you, man. Yeah. All right. All right. So we got Berwin and Commons coming up. These guys played pretty often. This was a uh, grand finals last last week or uh, two weeks ago. Uh, Berwin plays as a Buki or Jury a lot, and Commons plays that you. And uh, Commons plays a very, very, very scary Urian, like a world famous Urian. He's been on excellent adventures a couple of times in his body Gutex and Micros. So this guy's he he's seen some stuff. Oh, they're yeah. going right at it as soon as they start off. Yeah, definitely. They're going to be... This is a pretty fast-paced offensive matchup. Like, not very defense, not very defensive on either side. They're both trying to get their offense going and dealing with each other's buttons as they get in there. Yeah, I saw it was Alex uh, a little earlier. He was playing kind of different with Alex. It wasn't the more defensive play. He was just going in for counters and connectors back and back. Oh, yeah, definitely. Kamos is... Got, he, he likes to speed up the pace of his matches a lot because like, he's very experienced, so like he, he's familiar with all these situations. So he likes putting people in the, like in in the pace of the game to where it's like all about reactions and experience. And he takes that first round against Berwin with a pretty convincing life leap. Berwin's gonna have to adjust pretty quick here. Yeah, as you can see right there, he with like four buttons, like very defensive, like he's like got a crazy proactive defense, like he's using buttons on his way in all the time. Yeah, you can see Ibiki kind of struggling to try to get her fitting right now. Yeah, definitely. The match. It's already the second round, you can see that he's out. Oh yeah. But as we say that, Buki got a crush counter in the corner, was able to, uh, to capitalize off of the filler. But definitely doing better in this round than he was last round. That jab pressure. You got Reed fireballs all going up the air. Uh, he's left, and I think that's going to be a, a main factor if he takes this match. That shield, V reversal. Buki using up all the V bar, doesn't going to have access to those bomb mix ups. Yeah, Berwin's playing real defensive right now. You see all that gray life up on the Uri inside? Oh. oh my lord. He is non-stop right now. There he is, predicting attacks. Very nice uh, knee drop over the V-Skill. Boop getting the counter oh. into a grab, into another counter here, crouch, medium punch. Berwin able to take that round. Final round. All right, final round coming up between these guys in the first game. Back medium punch. I wonder what that is on block. I need to know my frame down. Yeah, we got both of these two very, like, proactive with their offenses and their defenses, using the right buttons at the right time, trying to fight, get a frame advantage. 
Nice tag. You can see both of them are very focused right now. Both of them. Oh, yeah, they're hard out. There's no wasted space, no wasted movement. Oh, yeah. Oh. Nice crash counter. Nice completion of the combo. It took a lot of damage off Yuri and bringing life into Yuri, uh, Mika's favor. It's about even here. Both of them got full, uh, full everything, full resources. Yuri activates his V trigger. Luke is very dangerous with that full V trigger bar. Still got two bars to work with. And Yurian's got a super to confirm into at any moment. Back, throw into the corner. Buki's on chip now. Oh, no chip in this game, no. <laughs> but. Oh no, we got the booms into the boom bomb combos. Whoa, That's dead. Oh, oh man. Abuki's always dangerous. You see the character, <laughs> you see the players reacting. Combos is upset about that one. He's up. <laughs> you see him cursing Abuki's life right now. That cursing. Yeah, there's just... no, there's no time to rest in Street Fighter. Oh man, I, I can tell you, man, that that damn ninja, darn kids. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Berwin taking the first mat or right, taking the first game. Going back into it. Oh man. You're eating the eating second one already. Down. That stun's already getting racked up. We're not even past 90 seconds and Yuri's already almost done. Nice view reversal, dude. Get that ninja off. Get it out of your pockets. EX headbutt. That crouch medium punch, crouch medium punch and V's V skill are like Boogie's only good pokes, but they ain't, they're, they're not good ones. Curry's been working for uh, since the last match and the setup, and I, I can't wait to see what it looks like. Right? Haven't got to see the most uh, flashy of the uh, Asian setups. Boogie's, uh, uh, Burns doing a good job of keeping, uh, staying away from the Aegis. He knows that it's like once he gets into any of those setups, it's gonna be a lot of damage. He's not gonna be able to use his bombs. He just wants to stay away from it. Got some feeling this right now. Combo's the guy be feeling the pressure. He's one round away from going down the loser's bracket pretty early in the tournament. Oh, thank you. Hey. Game waters uh, provided by Source Gaming staff here. Very hospitable people. Oh man. Being relentless right now. We got bomb combos. We got damage in the corner. Yurian's almost done. This is almost the end of oh. Matt. Combos is his winner's bracket. Oh, here right. we go. Here we go. But we got age of setups back into the corner for a Buki. Set up the other ones. Oh, oh, no! That's it. oh, oh no. dude, that was that was actually a little crazy. That Combos <laughs> is it's freaking out right now. He's Combos is very upset. He's hitting chairs. He's he's hitting. <laughs> he was very upset. <laughs> <I'll> just... <laughs> I can't, I can't help but laugh at that one. I was very excited into that last match. Yeah, that was uh, nice. <laughs> that's exactly what Abuki likes to do, man. She likes to get you in the corner. She likes to put on a pressure, and she likes to get you into those bomb combos and setups. And if you let her do that, it's not going to be a good day for you. And Combos knows yeah, that now. The Burns just been playing offensive. Are we playing soon? Oh, he's just vanilla freeze, just giving us some, give, showing us some love. Oh, that was awesome. That was a nice match. That, that, was, that was a fun match. Kamos and Burren <laughs> always have good matches here. That Abuki.